Yeah. Tunnel time. <laughs> We're going to work. This is where I work, even though I don't do anything bus related. As we come out of this tunnel, as you look to your left, you will see, well, you can kind of see our rows of planes parked up there. Lots and lots of Boeing 767s. Oh, yeah. Look at those. Nice. I don't ever get to see planes up close like this, so I do. I, uh, yeah. That's DHL. It's Amazon. It's so, cool. fun fact DHL does not own any of its American planes anymore. They're all contracted out. Really? The European ones it owns and operates. Peterman? <laughs> What's Just, that? You said contracted out, and I said Peterman. Not to Peterman. <laughs> no. That was a stupid joke. I'm, yes, it was. I'm sorry. This is Amazon's. Huh. Somewhere down there, you can see it from up there, but you really can't see it from down here. It's a little lean dirty. I will slow down. That belongs to this construction company. We'll see if we can see it. Somewhere down there. That's the car jackets. They're like. Can you see it? Uh, I. I don't. Unless they're using it. Mm. There it is. There it is. You see oh. it down there? Yeah. Huh. We're going to pull in here and get a picture. Airplanes. That right there, the gray and white one, is a 737. Yeah. We do, or, uh, no, that's a 727. Oh, actually. really? We, we still have one contractor. Um, not Peterman. No, not <laughs> Can we leave Peterman alone for one day? Is it? God's wait. Sake. Is it first student? It's not first student. Okay. More liable than that, thankfully. But we have I would hate to see first student being in charge of an airline. I really would. First, first airlines. It's awful. But yeah, we have contract. We have a contractor who still flies. I think they have two 1980 models and one oh, wow. 1971 built 727. Wow. They're still out flying cargo every day. That's cool. So they keep them in shape. Huh. They also. They also Operate a plane called Air Horse One, which is used for transporting, transporting horses. <laughs> Air Horse One. I was just kidding, but I'm totally I, I believe it. I really do. Huh. If I was a horse, I would like to fly in a plane. If I was a horse, things would be a lot different. <laughs> yeah. I would say, really. Well, that was, uh, that was his workplace and the planes associated with it. Yeah, fun stuff. So shall, shall we elaborate on where we're going today? I believe I'm getting a phone call. Huh? My phone is vibrating. So after a phone call with our friend Adam, we're here now. Uh, let me say uh, congratulations to Adam on getting married to... Uh, <laughs> has, he now, has he made any I videos? don't think so. Oh, okay. He uh, just made married. a really specific hint that just kind of gave it I most of it say, away. No, I didn't get anything away. Well, okay. I'm just saying there's something that Adam Did is you going see to make a video about. Huh? The hint he posted. That's what I'm talking about. Did you see that? No. Well, then you don't know what I'm talking about. He posted a Not hint really, picture no. of it, and okay. I'm probably going to have to end up cutting all this out because I <laughs> doubt that he's going to let me post this. But, anyways, um, I, I would like to congratulate Adam on getting married to the thing that he is about to get. <laughs> Quiet on the set, please. So, any, <laughs> anyways, um, you know, actually, light profanity is okay. As long as I mark the video that it has light profanity, I can still make money. I don't think so. Um, but, anyways, yeah. Traffic. So, as we were trying to say before we got interrupted, uh, where did you, you were asking where we were going, right? Is that what, what was happening? Oh, I, I was going to offer oh. an explanation. Yes. What is it with semis today? It's going to keep going on, isn't it? Uh, yeah. We should get rid of all the semis. That's a great idea. I know. I'll just all <laughs> shit in the back of our trucks. <laughs> anyway, um, so, 
Is this our first trip down to Kentucky? Our first vlog of a trip down to Kentucky? Uh, yeah. I believe it is. Well, we're heading I don't think me and you have ever had a, a real Kentucky trip. I was just thinking about that. Because, like, we've never gone bus hunting in Kentucky. Yeah. Because you don't like Kentucky buses. Not really, but that doesn't mean I wouldn't want to take see well, them. it's a good thing you don't like Kentucky buses. Because today we're going to see some... Actually, maybe not get destroyed, but we're going to see them race. Right. Um, we are going down to the Sports Drone Speedway. Uh, not in Louisville, as a matter of fact. All right. Fact, right across the river from Louisville in Clarksville, Indiana. Nice. That's right. We're going to Indiana, not Kentucky. Yeah. But... I feel like we should make note of the vehicle we're in. As soon as I can talk, I will. What is that, a Condor? It's a like Freightliner. Yeah. Like Wait, that's not Perfetic. Anyway, so, yes, uh, this is my new uh, whip, or hoopty, as they call it. Uh, it's it got is. a sunroof. It does have a sunroof, as a matter of fact. I say, we open that bad boy up. Yeah. Switch goes in. We're really rolling in style now. Heck yes, we are. Look at really, this. Really, that's really getting those cicadas in now. That's why I haven't opened it up all the way. Yeah, that's understandable. This is my uh, my new ride, 2005 Pontiac 5. It's it's nice. I my color. Wait, the color is my favorite part of it. Yes, it is. It's very nice. Unfortunately, the paint really isn't in the best shape. Yeah. But yes, it's a very nice color. It's uh, <laughs> the interior could use some work. Right. Like for example, uh, you may have noticed as you got in, there is an extra luxurious towel under your feet. I did it's, not. Yes, there is a towel. Down oh there. yeah, I see that. Yeah, from Walmart. Uh, that's because uh, this week, while it was raining, I took a curve too hard and. The hose that drains from the roof that oh. runs under the glove box came loose, and now every time it's raining and I take a sharp left turn, there is a little torrent of water that gushes out huh. and soaks the carpet, so that's why there's a towel. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> apart from that, it's been great. Well, that's apart good. Apart from that, and taking four months to get the title. Oh, yeah. Because I remember when you come to C45, you yes, had it, I had that and it still was not a very, like it, it wasn't even really yours yet. No, I didn't have the file transfer, I didn't have the plates, and as soon as we get to the track, I'll show off my fancy first line plates. Heck yeah. Because again, something to do with this. Yeah. But, yes, it's, it's in my name, it's insured, it's registered, it's on the road, and life is good, and if anyone anyone working for TGT Transport is watching this video, screw you. Because we deal with your crap on the truck dock every day. This wow. Is, this is my day off and I don't want to see that. Uh, really? Alright. <laughs> Tug and pull LLC. That's a name for a trucking company. <laughs> Very yes, fun. Yes, I work for the tug and pull company. Oh, what do you do? <laughs> Don't you love being sandwiched between two semis? Can, can you back it up too, or do you just tug and pull? Tug and pull. Sorry, can't do that. You're going to have to go to another company for the backup. We can only tug it and pull it. Back it and tug. Anyway. Tug yes. and pull. It's my new little car. Yeah. It's nice. So, um... Did you have anything else to say about the destination? Um, oh, well, I didn't actually talk about the destination at all, really. Yeah, because um, trucks kept interrupting you. So this this place, the Sports Room Speedway, is arguably, arguably, sorry, arguably home of the uh, most watched. I would say they're the most watched bus races on YouTube. Um, yeah. 
school bus figure eight races, they have them about three times a year, I think. Yeah. This is the first one. Um, it's not like Lawrenceburg, if you haven't seen it yet. Number one, because it's uh, figure eight. Right. It's not, I mean, it's noble, but they do a figure eight for the buses. And uh, it's on pavement. It's not a dirt track like Lawrenceburg. Right. And uh, third of all, it's unlike Lawrenceburg, it is explicit, explicitly like a demolition derby yeah. type of that. Like, people leave here disappointed if there's not at least one flip or one big crash or something. Right. I know that because the last race I went to didn't have any flips or big crashes and people were very disappointed. Very disappointed. And they took to social media to express They're like, their disappointment. But, so it's a, it's a different type of bus racing than Lawrenceburg. Uh, different type of crowd yeah. than Lawrenceburg. Right. I will not go any further on that and I will let you judge it on your own. Use your own imagination. Here. Yeah. Um, neat. Oh, and I, I should also mention uh, that there is more racing going on tonight than just the buses. Right. Like Lawrenceburg, where there were some other classes like the modified. And the yeah. Modifieds. Um, my favorite uh, consistent class at the Sports Drome is the Crown Victoria. Oh class, yeah. The full size. There's a uh, Grand Marquis right there. Yeah, just like that. Looks pretty nice. You took the windows and the interior out and put the number on the door and put a roll cage in. He would. You could race it. He would qualify. Yeah. Yeah. And I'll be honest. It's take a really minute. Something that I nice. would like to do. Yeah. Sometimes I think that would be right. just be a boatload of fun. It probably would. I agree. So yeah, we're gonna have some fun. We're gonna see a bunch of racing, not just buses. Yeah. yeah. You know, I I think the last time I went with you, the video that I did was like over an hour worth of footage, but yes. I think I cut it down to 45 minutes. Yeah. That was um, right after I got this camera, so I was really excited about being able to fill like film long uh, videos. Uh -huh. This video, I, I'm not gonna. It's not gonna be 45 minutes. Yeah. At least I hope not. We'll see. Um, yeah. Um, by the way, I was going through. This is just an note to you personally, okay. not necessarily your subscribers. I noticed I was going through my copyright claims on one of my channels. Yeah. Um, I noticed that the video we did at the track in Indianapolis is no longer viewable. Really? Because the background music they use at the speedway, yeah, there see, was a copyright claim involving that. See, that's the thing with filming these races. Like last year when they did Baby Shark, I was really concerned oh, yeah. when that I was going to get a copyright claim about it. And that's like why I kind of hate filming the races when they play music. Yeah. Because then I have to worry about can it be heard? And I'm pretty sure I had to cut stuff out because of it. That makes sense. Um, because, you know, I'm ahead of the game. I don't wait until I get the copyright claim. I if, if I can salvage it to where it doesn't have that, then I take it out. I have not had a copyright claim in probably five or six years. So... Oh, yeah? Yeah, I have. Nothing against Dodges, but they breed new stories. Yeah. Um, so did you have anything else to, to say for this part of the video? No, but the trucker next to me does. With his loud engine. Yeah. All right. It's we will... Uh... <laughs> what do you have to say about that? I'm on camera. All right. Well, we'll be back soon yeah. we, will, we will pick it up later. Let's give a word for our sponsor, uh, Tug and Pull LLC. Yeah, tug and pull you know how it goes. You know. Oh. Oh, they said they were storing these here, and I didn't know what they meant. Fort trucks. Oh. Wow. Holy crap. That, that's a lot of trucks. A lot of trucks. We've been asking ourselves, oh is it possible to lend money? I want to buy a Ford. <laughs> Toyota Parker. <laughs> I'll see any Toyota. When you need extra cash, you can qualify for between $100 and $1,000 at Huntington. And it's free when you yeah. pay us back across three months. Why would a bank First year without a race here. Huh. In uh, nine years. Wow. That's interesting. 
interesting. Luckily, you can't still drive around the perimeter. Plus, there's a bonus. A bonus? A bonus! Oh. That's right. There's a junkyard with little buses uh, right next to the track. Peter, why on earth would you think I would want to see old buses? Just a suspicion. I know you love the new stuff, especially these Thomas's. Oh ones. yeah, I'm never gonna live that down. Oh no, not until you take that hitch off. All right. I'm sorry about my windshield. I know it's part of book juice. Yeah, it's okay. Cicada juice. That's stupid cicadas. Yeah, my thoughts. How bad exactly. would that be? Going to watch a race here and being swarmed by cicadas. Oh, that would suck. I would not be a fan. I do not care for cicadas. So, there's a track. Oh. Nice. Zoom in over there. Interesting. Huh. Whatever they want, I guess. So I guess it's still technically open for some events and stuff, but for huh. now it's... Uh, Interesting. Thomas Vistas and Looper 3800s that they use for shuttles oh, yeah. these campgrounds out here. But those were owned, if I'm not mistaken, by the company that owns the Speedway. Hmm. And by the Speedway themselves. So they have all been vamoosed down to somewhere else. Vamoosed. That's interesting. The more you know. Yeah. yeah. No, no, one of the Fords is following us. You guys, uh... Hear the cicadas. Alright, so if you look, you won't be able to stop, but if you look. Oh, oh yeah, there. Oh. So I think that's a little carpenter. Hmm. There's the, uh. This is the world's sign highest stop sign. Oh, yeah, that is, uh. Yes. Very nice. Yeah, that's the biggest speedway. That's right! It's, uh, as, far, as close as we can get. Yeah. Well. Um, Not the speedway we were no. uh, aiming for today, but we're still on our way to the other one. Yeah. I promise we'll get there eventually. Eventually. Yeah. It's just like the SpongeBob where it's like four hours later. Four hours later. So uh, this is my new plate. It's my personalized plate. Yeah. For the 44 bus, of course. Right. Because I always wanted a personalized plate and racing bus is my current project and its number is 44 44 yeah 44 could you imagine if i had gotten the wayne numbered 44 44 this is this is this made the whole trip worth it <laughs> fun in, yeah in the plants yeah this with the rest of this we don't care about we just came to see the fun right i think we can go now peter go where go home can we keep the bun sure i love the bun <laughs> You heard it here Let's first. You heard it here first, folks. It's he you, loves the bun. Folks, folks, folks. folks. I don't know what you I'm heard saying. It her, folks. You hear? You heard it here first. Lebanon. Lebanon. It's Lebanon. Lebanon. Sorry, it's not. Lebanon. There's another bun. There are more buns. <laughs> They're everywhere. The crop is fruitful this year. <laughs> <laughs> it really is. Plants are sprouting. Maybe that's where the cicadas uh, are coming. Oh, yeah. The cicada or the, uh, yes. This one. Is that the, the Vistiva? Instead of instead of Festiva, it's Vistiva. Oh. Huh. <laughs> this Amtran looks pretty untouched for the most part. Why would you do that to a perfectly good Vista? Why would you do that to a perfectly good rusty ass Thomas Vista? Yeah. Uh, oh, that one we have to check out too. Cause that's the old Ohio bus. Oh. That's all you had to say was old Ohio bus, and I'm in. I am in. Yep. That's an Am train, all right. This is most certainly an Am train FE, because the engine's in the front. The engine is in the front. It's not in the rear. It's not in the rear. You got you right there. 
has this bad boy. Let's look at this Thomas. Take a look at this bad boy over here. Yeah. Look at the bulb. This is another bus in perfectly good condition. It, it, yeah. It was, in fact, purchased used from the same dealer that Lebanon got its Peterman buses from. Really? Yeah. American bus accessories. Huh. This was from up here in Columbus. It was from Gehanna Jefferson. So, wait. We didn't get it directly from Peterman? Hmm? We didn't get no, those... No, I mean, the, originally, this one was... No, I mean, but us, when we got our... Those didn't come from Peter. I thought they just no, came. No, they were the ones stored at that dealer. Oh, okay. Okay. Or some of them were. Oh, okay. Right. Okay. The more you know. Yep. Uh, huh. The more you know. No, this one was bought by an insulation contractor here. Yeah. I'm still, I'm still really not sure. You know what's interesting here? What's interesting? Oh, wait. Never, no, no, it is. It's got it's the red emblem. Oh, that is true. It's a, and it's got an emblem on it, on the hood. Because most of the time when it's the red emblem, that means it's an 89. And they... That went up to 91. No, I mean, without an emblem, usually they wouldn't oh, have yeah. emblems on the hoods. This one... Oh, I can't remember what year this one was. I think it's either 91 or 92. Huh. Early 90s. Interesting. Hey, guys... It's a church bus on the down low. Here's the difference. This was a church bus. This is a church bus. <laughs> yeah. Church bus. church bus. Right. Thank I you. I just like to keep quiet. Guys. Thank you for the clarification on that. You're welcome. I, I think it's needed. Yep. Sounds so funny. It's the church bus. The lowercase church bus. <laughs>
finally quit just before the race. You know? Probably. of other uh, things before we could actually see what we wanted to see, but... I'm sure there are enthusiasts for those kinds of races, but we are not yet. Yeah. Fair enough. Right. But, um... Yeah. So, I mean, that's... That's pretty much that. What? Glad you enjoyed it. What? Glad you enjoyed it. 
yeah. I, I hope you guys enjoyed it too. Um, I don't know what else to say about it, but do you, you have any uh, closing remarks? One off him. Alright, well, uh, that should be it for this video. Um, thank you guys for watching. Let me know what you think, and uh, yeah. Keep those cars and letters coming in. Yeah, exactly. It always swarms as hard. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and uh, if you're looking for us, we might be out somewhere lost on the freeway. Yeah. Because my memory hasn't been the most reliable when it comes to highways. So, uh, we'll see what happens. Yeah. Alright. Yeah. Bye. Tunnel. It's a tunnel. Tunnels. Oh crap, it's a tunnel. Where did it uh, go? Oh my god. Look how that fun. Big fan. Big fan. I am a big fan. I'm a big fan. Big fan. Yeah, big fan. So you're a bus yeah. fan, huh? Absolutely. Yeah, well these are any kind of vehicle fan up here. Right. So they can be a truck fan or a car right. fan. And I got salt in my eye from my friend. Oh, and that was this the tunnel.